Hello everyone, this is Introvert Shy Guy, and welcome back to Persona 3. Okay, so we left off, we defeated the last, um, sh the last shadow boss, and we're now into a new month, exploring a new section of Tar Tartarus. Uh, Shinjiro is, has now joined uh, our team. I haven't used him yet, but I will, I will now, since I'm exploring a new section of Tartarus, so, uh, yeah, look forward to that. So yeah, anyway, today is March the 18th. Um, yeah, so if you want to know what happened, I wasn't able to go to the, uh, hang on, wait, 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 I will just want to make sure, okay, yeah, it's file, file one, I want to make sure I kept that one intact, you know, like, up to date, I mean, like, because I remember I was saving my second file. Okay, so, uh, I didn't have time to go to the supermarket before, because at that time when I was, like, just doing my usual routine and everything, I kind of ordered food from someplace, but unfortunately they took... Um, a little while longer, I would say, for my meal to show up, so, which it wasn't a big deal, I, but I had to wait 20 to 30 minutes, uh, so, uh, because of that incident, uh, I decided to not, to, to not go to the supermarket, honestly, I probably would have not gone there anyway, because I thought maybe it's a good time to try to show up here early, well, even though I, I went straight back home, it's like 9.25, I can never, like, play this game as early as I want it to be for some fucking reason, I don't know, it's just, it happens man, like, uh, sometimes it's so frustrating, you know this thing in life where you're gonna do something earlier than usual and you, you do commit, you try doing that, and then yet, even, th even though you still, when you start doing something, it's still pretty late, or the same as usual time as you do stuff, so it's quite unfortunate. You know, that this happened, like, you can leave in the comments if some of this has ever happened to you or something like that. So, okay, I only have 6,000. Uh, so, yeah, uh, here's what I'm gonna do. Because I said before I wanted to, to bond one more time with Yukari because I did this one thing and it didn't really do anything. And I'm going, I'm now approaching the point where I'm probably gonna have to date with Fuka and solidify the relationship. And when that happens, I, I don't think I can... You know, hang out. I yeah, I wouldn't hang out with any other girl as until she's like maxed out. Then I guess I could probably hang out with other characters and see what happens. You know, like hopefully it doesn't amount to anything. Cause uh, so then I can at least get some social uh, like some points for upgrading personas and everything, which is what I want to do. But I can't do just yet until I max out Fuka. So uh, because of what happened, I'm I'm thinking of like you know. Just date Yukari one more time, and then once it once the new social link level is upgraded, then I'll go to Tartarus. So for now, we're just gonna uh, focus on other stuff. I'm also gonna sacrifice the feeling great, you know, thing. So, hang on. Hi, it's Yukari. Do you have a minute? Uh, I'm curious. Yeah. Hey, you want to do something next Sunday? Can't do that. I'm hanging out with Ka with Kaz. I remember that. Decline. Oh well, maybe some other time. You can already have seem disappointed. That's all right, because I already made reservations for Ka for Ka for Kaz. I was gonna say Kaz again for some reason. Okay, let's study for now. Considering that, like, if we're not gonna go to Tartarus, I mean, what if we go to Tartarus tomorrow? That's okay. Then I can sacrifice another day. I don't mind it. So right now, I want to focus on academics. So even though I'm not going to feel great next time, that's okay, I'm going to rest up again and like, you know, feel great again. So, yeah, that's what we're doing. So, yeah, I wasn't able, I'm not, I decided not to go to the supermarket today. I'll go tomorrow on Sunday. And I think it's good because it's like, Sundays I don't really go anywhere and usually I eat at McDonald's and stuff. I feel like maybe it's a good time to shop on a Sunday. Why not? Morning. Hey, Minato-kun. I wonder why Shinjiro Senpai came back so suddenly. He has a lot of power. <laughs> I'll say don't know. He's kind of... Hang on. Mm, excuse me. He's kind of scary if you ask me. But it doesn't seem like he's rejoining Cease just because he likes to fight. <clears throat> Alright. Hello class, ba Bagalaka Bachaba. <laughs> Are you ready? Then let's begin. Today we'll discuss the magic of Renaissance. 
The Renaissance was a time when the arts and the sciences enjoyed a resurgence in Europe. Naturally, this had a profound influence on magic. It might be more accurate to say the two studies helped improve one another. As to why the Renaissance helped to further magic, they had found a way to escape the rule of the church by studying the teachings of previously forbid forbidden sects and knowledge of magic spread it greatly. The Renaissance also brought about the revival of ancient Greek and Roman literature. Magical texts such as the Her Hermetica received new translations and study. Philosophy, natural history, alchemy, astrology. The book was filled with a wide range of subjects and could be called the Bible of Magic. Just as science and astronomy have made strides in the modern day, so too has the art of magic. You can see this in the, in the emergence of a great magician who applied the knowledge of the Renaissance. John Dee was a professor who advised the Queen of England, but with the magical knowledge he obtained, he obtained, he was able to talk to angels. You know, I know the guy, John Dee, from when I played the game uh, Zombie U. Basically in that game, you know how there's a zombie apocalypse that happens and stuff? The guy that's called the Prepper, like, talks about John Dee. So basically John Dee, like, prophesized about the zombie outbreak and everything. I don't know, maybe he also said how to prevent it or something. He probably just, it's just prophesized about a zombie outbreak. And so that's kind of how I knew about it. The Prepper started talking about a John Dee about stuff. And, like, certain clues also related to John Dee, I guess. But yeah. That's kind of how I knew about the guy, basically from that game Zombie U. It talks about the guy a little bit, or half the time, you know, something like that. That's how I tell you guys that. But then there, were, there was Honiem, a doctor who traveled across Europe, never heard of him. He became known as Paraculus, a renowned physician and alchemist. Of course, the magician's life wasn't an easy one. Both men lived lives riddled with persecution. Are you all listening? Keep your minds down to earth. Eh, hey, hey. Here is a test to see if you were paying attention. Get it wrong and your house will become irrevocably haunted. Bagala Now, who should, I, who should be the, my victim? Minato, I ask thee. Which book helped further the art of magic during the Renaissance? Okay, the Book of... Uh, book of Enoch, the Book of Thoth, the Hermetica. Correct, back to your peaceful life. Magic at the time had a great influence on the church world society. I'm always like just acing this guy's question, man. Like considering that I'm, I'm kind of into this kind of stuff. Like, you, do you guys know how I was very fascinated with like magic and sorcery back when I was a kid? You know, in the sense that I actually wanted to live in a world like that. Hence why I was very attached to the fantasy stuff from like cartoons, TV shows, movies, video games, that kind of thing and how I want to leave this life, be, be isekai into the other life, that's kind of, that's, this kind of stuff is like, piquing my interest in a way, you know? Yeah, I think at the time I had a great influence on the church rule society. I don't know if I already read that. If I did, I apologize. Several magicians were involved with the central part of the Renaissance, the religious revolution. Give the correct answer, I can, a charm as a goal. That's useless, because I already have max charm. All right. Plus is in for today. And Fuka. Uh, uh, why was I about to say Fuka? I meant Yukari. Yukari's not here. Uh, Kaze is here. Maybe I can hang out with him. Should I hang out with Kaze? I would say, yeah, I would say, yeah. Because, I mean, the old couple, we can do it another time, you know? And if Fuka's available, we can't hang out with her because, um, you know, like, then we would have to stick with her as the only female. And we can't do that yet. Okay, let's hang out with Kaze, why not? Or oh, wait, actually, maybe I think I should hang out with Kaze because it might not do anything, considering that I'm gonna be hanging out with him on a Sunday, that would increase the relationship thing, so maybe I should do that later. So you know what, let's go to the old couple, see if we can max that out already. Because I know the old couple's nine. Okay, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. We'll do Kaze later. Like, after we hang out with him casually on a Sunday, and then, you know... That should be good. I do have some stuff to talk about, but right now we're not, I'm gonna hold that off to, like, re go to Tartarus, because, um... I know for a fact I'm going to Tartarus at some point, so I just want to hold that off for a sec. Alright. Hopefully, this will max them out, because I do want to max them out, you know? If not, then oh well. And we can maybe try again on a Saturday, I guess. I don't know. 
And then once they're done, and the little girl's all that's left with the social link outside, besides Tanaka, but Tanaka's at night. Okay, yeah, she, yeah. Would you like to spend some time? Enter bookstore. Let's see if it maxes out. Oh shit, not yet. Your relationship can become strong. Okay, yeah, next time it's, it's, it's gonna solidify it. It's getting late, so I have to go back to the dorm. Okay, we weren't able to socialize with, with Yukari, so we're gonna skip another date from going to Tartarus and, you know, hey. uh, do, it, do it a little later, you know? If you use Attack Fallen, we will attack any of that have a knockdown. Uh, yeah, forget it. I know that already. Shinjiro Senpai's weapon has a very wide, wide range of attack. Its attack speed is slow, but its range more than makes up for it. It's a useful weapon when you want to surprise the enemy. He, he uses an axe, by the way, so kind of like Haru. But except he was first to use an axe, Persona 3 before Persona 5, you know. Ken could use a spear, so he's, uh, we already read that, I remember. We probably won't be going to the hospital again. Sidori hates, oh, okay, I already read that. Remember that? Kormara-san wants to communicate something to you. He decided to be eating the same food day after, I already read that. I'll think about it. Arf arf. <laughs> the Kormara said that, sorry. My persona of strength and endurance both. Yeah. yeah. Guess select isn't that great. Wait, hold on, let me, let me read it again. That was a new sentence. A new thing, a speech thing. I presume strength and endurance both increase his fast. His skills and agility aren't bad either. Ca Caster doesn't have any weaknesses. Well, I guess its luck isn't that great, but that doesn't matter in battle. If you gotta depend on luck, then you're as good as dead. Mm, excuse me. Uh, Alright, so that's it. I don't know, I think maybe Junpei's upstairs. I think he is upstairs. <laughs> yeah, there he is. Let's see if he says something new. Let's say someone t tells me... Uh, how does that sound? Is it awkward? No, not really. Okay. Alright. Um, no, we still can't go to Tartarus just yet because I need to still communicate with Fuka. Fuck, Yukari. I'm always saying Fuka. I deeply apologize. It's just how I am. Sometimes I make that mistake. Where's Ken, anyway? Should I, like, find him? I'm not gonna look for him that much, but I don't know if he is somewhere. I don't, I don't think he is. Alright. Now let's go... Oh, hey, ha let me talk to, Kor uh, to Kormaru, just in case he wants to go to a walk, so then I would know. Or... Oh, shit. There was nothing to speak of, and I could've just... Whatever. Kormaru's still gonna say he's not before. Okay, so if... if, can, if Tanaka is not there, and maybe I could just do quiz game. I know I have 6,000, but we'll get a shit ton of money in Tartarus anyway, so... Yeah, and oh shit, you know. I kind of, I'm for, I know some of you guys are wondering, I'm kind of forgetting to go to the nurse's office to pick up that special medicine, but I just don't know if that thing would take up an entire day or something, so that's, and why I'm like, my thoughts was occupied with going to the old couple trying to maximize, so I kind of forgot about that. Let's see. Okay, so it's not available. So okay, we'll we'll go to Kor Koromaru. Oh wait, he's not moving for a walk. Okay, so we're just gonna go straight to my room. Now I also looked up about the uh, nightclub thing and what's its purpose there. Okay, so there's apparently a social link that is called a tower that's available. I'm not gonna do that. I have a lot of social links I'm focusing on. I'm not interested in the tower social links. So yeah, we won't do the nightclub thing. I'm only focusing on Tanaka. At night. But alright. Okay, what will you do? Uh, let's go back to the room. We're gonna study again because uh, I haven't socialized with Yukari just yet, so why not just study? Bear in mind, once I max out on the academics thing, then there's no need to like study and do all the other stuff and everything. Hopefully she's there on a Saturday. I don't know if she is, but she might be.
The next chapter discusses the problems of the Kamakura Shogunate. Kamakura is cool and all, but it can't beat the Sengoku era. Have we covered enough of this yet? I can skip over the Sengoku era, yeah? Alright, let's take a close look at the Sengoku era from the beginning. As you all know, it's generally agreed that a major factor leading up to the Sengoku era was the Ohonin War in 1467. After that, the next big event in the Sengoku era's formation was the coup of Mayo in 1493. Let's look closer on the Ohonin War in 1467. Feel tired. Close your eyes for- no, let's stay away. Get that academic increase. Wow, it's, is it time off already? I can't believe that went by so fast. We're only up to 1467, but there's still a lot to cover. I guess it can't be helped. Next time we'll jump to 1468. Sweet. No one else is coming today. But they said we can't give you back to Revoca. I wasn't expecting them to. That's why they started watching me in the first place. Oh, how's that cut doing? Probably already healed, huh? So, uh, how come you're not drawing today? Does it matter? Well, uh, not really. Hey, they're all dried up. I guess it's been pretty hot lately. It's okay. I'll take care of it. Damn, that's awesome. She's like E.T. Oh, what was that? <laughs> Remember that scene in E.T.? He actually brings those flowers from wilting to like blossoming and stuff. I love that scene. I made them healthy again. You can do that? That's incredible, Chidori. It's nothing special. You have powers too, don't you? Well, yeah, I guess. That's about all I've got going for me. Yeah, his powers are mostly for fighting, not for anything else like what she did. Not that, I'd be a nobody. I just talk a big game, pretending like I'm some kind of hero. But in reality, I don't know what the hell I'm fighting for, or why I'm here at all. Why? Why we are here? When I was a kid, I had this crazy dream. What kind of dream? That one day I'd grow up to be a pro baseball player. Pretty stupid, huh? I guess that's part of being a kid. Is that so? I don't remember much from my childhood. All I remember is being surrounded by white. Huh? I hate hospitals. Yeah, me too. <sighs> I'm sorry. But I don't mind that much this time, since you come to see me so often. Chidori? I understand. I won't let you down. Okay, great. She's available. So yeah, let's hang out with her. Hey, Minato-kun. Are you walking by back here? So, uh, I don't know why I'm reading it, even though I know what she's gonna say. Sorry. Except the offer. Great, let's go. Yeah, same thing. Okay. This will do it. Oh, what the fuck? Are you serious? I thought she was she was this close. You feel your relationship growing stronger as you spend time with Hikari. Okay, next time. What the fuck, man? It's getting dark out. It's time to go back to the dorm. You know what, that's okay, that's okay. We'll still keep on going with this. It's now, because now I know for a fact the next one- I thought it was going to be the, the last time, I'm so sorry. Hey. I don't regret doing it, because like I said, I'm, I'm keeping this on schedule. Like, when, once he's finished, then we'll go with, uh, with Fuka, so my apologies. We're still going to have to do a little bit longer with this. Whenever I'm around you, okay, sense a feeling of happiness. I wonder what happened to him. 
Can Jiro Senpai's weapon has a... Okay, yeah. Do you use attack for... Okay, same thing, yeah. Shinjiro-san used his own money to purchase expensive dog food. Really expensive? Okay. Kumara-san seems to really like it. He's going for a high-quality dog food. I don't think he wants to walk, he's eating, right? In a very good mood. Okay, yeah. Very good mood, but not in the mood for a walk. Have you ever thought of what you're living for? Yes. Oh, I never knew you were so deep. <laughs> Whether or not I fit into your battle plan is up to you. If you do, if I do great, if I don't, whatever. I'm not going to change my style for you or anyone else. Yeah, interesting. Okay, let's see if Ken is upstairs. In case I want to talk to him. He, I'm pretty sure he's in the boys' floor, because that's where you, you go. Never in the halls, okay. So that's it. Kormar says not in the mood for a walk, so we're going to go see if Tanaka is there. We can hang out with him. If he's not, we'll see if quiz game is available, and if that's not available, then we just go and... Oh, okay, there's that Kihiko. We probably won't be going to the... Oh, okay, same thing. Alright, that's fine. And Tanaka's available. Yeah, let's do it. See, and not take the one. Yeah. Charge. Yes. He's not there all the time, you know. Before I enlighten you today, do you notice anything different about me? Uh, like what? Are you blind? Prison time. I, I know I could have just said the uh, other option, but I'm just curious. I had an appointment at the spa for a facial peel. Is my skin simply radiant now? I'm afraid it's all part of the job. I have my fans to think of. At home, I'm completely the opposite. I dress like a slob and only shower once every three days. Let me give you an analogy. Prison time is me thinking. Vegetables. Perfect. Imagine an organically grown cucumber that looks deformed. Compare that to a cucumber that looks perfect, but was grown using chemical fertilizers and pesticides. Which one do you think the supermarket would stock? The one that looks good. That's the simple truth. The president has seems to be thinking. Awkward shaped cucumbers are difficult to stack, so stores prefer nice straight ones. Taste and safety are not really considered. Instead, they carry cucumbers that even mold won't eat. So why do consumers still buy these cucumbers when they know the truth? Simple. People trust what they see. Appearance matters most. That's why as much as I hate spending money, I buy expensive ties to win people's trust. Wait, you remember what I just said? About me dressing like a slob and not showering every day? Don't tell anyone. I can't afford to have people start believing I'm ordinary. I only said it because I, it was you. You're the only one who knows. That's, yeah, that's a good conversation about that. Obviously, people prefer appearance over everything else. It's also basic... I would say human biology or instinct, you know, we always try to go with something that looks nice, you know? Because that's our only intuition that we mostly trust. Or one of the few that we mostly trust. But maybe for average people, it's one that they always trust, I guess. Just a reminder, don't tell anyone if you break your promise. Well, I guess I can trust you. Run along now. Oh, that was very interesting. What will you do? We're gonna study again. Oh, okay. We're gonna upgrade the social link of death again. have passed since we met. Time goes by so quickly, and many things change. Yet some things will always remain the same. Don't you agree? Uh... 
I'm not sure how to answer that. Some things change, but everything remains the same. Honestly, I feel like everything changes. Hmm. If you say so, then perhaps I was mistaken. Talking with you has stirred up certain memories. That tower, for instance. I've been thinking about it lately. I wonder, will our relationship stay the same? Or will it evolve? No matter what the future holds, you and I will be friends. That is for certain. Man, you know, honestly, I kind of like this kind of little dynamic of him communicating with the shadow that's imprisoned in him. Obviously, he was a little kid because the shadow that was imprisoned in him was a little kid when he was a little kid as well. So it's kind of the same sort of bonding that like the same thing that happened when this whole thing happened. And of course, then you meet him again when he's basically the same age as the main character, which becomes a central thing. Sometime, I think it happens in November, I guess, when you meet him, or October, I don't know. You go to school today. You are meeting someone today, yeah. Meeting with Ka with Kaz. I don't believe in taking days off from practice, that's bullshit. That's why I can't tell anyone on the team about my knee. Looks depressed. Sorry, I didn't say Kazuchi looks depressed, sorry. I've been doing kendo team since I was in middle school and now they're telling me to stop. Kazuchi's face darkened. Dude, if this keeps up, I'll... Excuse me, I'll probably turn into one of those freaks in the news. You know, with apathy syndrome? I doubt it, you're worrying me. Uh... Hang in there. Even if it's painful, I have to try and hide it. I can't imagine not being up on the team, so I have to suck it up. Yeah, that was great. They wants something new about it. Okay, become stronger and decide to go back to the door. Alright, still not going to Tartarus just yet. We have to bond with, with Yukari just one time, then we'll go. Deeply apologize if this is taking longer than usual, but I just say you guys just hang in there for a sec. I heard Shinji's a really good cook. I can't say from experience though. I've never had anything he's made. How are you getting along with Shinjiro? He's a little rough around the edges, but deep down he's really a nice guy, just give him a chance. Oh yeah, he definitely is. Whether or not I fit into your battle plan, okay, yeah. Does he want to go for a walk? Seems to be in a very good mood. Nope. Alrighty then. And there's Ken. Kormaro always seems so happy, I'm a little jealous of him. He can be satisfied just eating a meal. I wish my life was that simple. <laughs> well, yeah, you'd have to be a dog in order to, you know, like simplistic emotions, you know? Anyway, let's go upstairs and see if maybe uh, Junpei is up. I think Yukari should be also up the upstairs. I've never seen her down. Oh, they're all up here. Nice. With Shinjiro-san as our ally, we are, more, uh, we are a more formidable force. This is the ideal time for us to ascend the Tartarus. Yep, the best defense is a good offense. That's how we win. Yeah, I wish we'd go now, but um, like I said, you know. Shinjiro-senpai is pretty dependable, don't you think? He's physically strong, but he also knows how to keep this cool. Yeah. He looks scary, but in reality, he's more like a big brother. With Shinjiro-san here, the atmosphere is so much more serious. With Junpei-san here, the atmosphere is so much more childish. <laughs> Ouch, that hurt, Ai-chan. I have no comeback for that. <laughs> Oh boy. Talk. I'm really happy Shinjiro Senpai joined us, but I need to be careful. If I rely too much on his skill, I'll never realize my true potential. Wow, you're amazing. Instead of being so amazed, maybe you should try to be more like her. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, we talked to everyone, so now let's go. I don't think Tanaka is available, but if the quiz game is available, then like we could just do that, I guess. And like ma try to maximize the... The stat. Let me just check one more time in case I'm not mistaken. Status. Yeah, it's not maxed out yet. We're close. You know, you see, you know this is the first time I'm actually going to max out uh, academics. But that's because I've been playing the quiz game. Before it was just studying as much as I can, I would say, but it never went anywhere. I don't know what rank I was before, but 
I don't know, it was something. Anyway, okay, it's almost 10 o'clock, so I'll obviously I'll, pro I'll stop at 11:30 or 11:40, 11:45, something like that, because obviously I have a uh, my show, my Hero Academia, so so yeah, punching bag, nothing available, so we'll just go straight to my room. Yeah, and if I feel like I want to play a little bit more, maybe I can make like something I did similarly when I did the. Um, when I fought the Herophant and Lover's Arcana boss battle, I could do that if I want, but we'll see what happens. But I feel like maybe I talked a lot as much as I can, and I'll probably just call it, but if not, if there's some stuff I want to talk about, play a little bit more, then maybe I could... I don't know. We'll see. Alright. I mean, we've been doing a lot, so it's good to probably save. Yeah, sacrifice these days even when we have We still have plenty of time, man. I'm definitely gonna bomb with her before this boss battle, so we still have plenty of time. As long as I keep the persona, the priestess persona, I should be good. What will you do? Go back to my room. Still gonna study again. Hopefully I won't go, grow tired, you know. What will you do? Study and go to sleep. And then once we max out academics, we can just sleep early, sleep early, sleep early whenever we want. However, you're stuck in your worst subject. Oh, okay. So I'm gonna have to skip a day. Feeling sleepy, I have to sleep. I have to, I have to skip a day and, like, you know, then get to where I'm feeling good. Hopefully, if, if Yukari is not available, then we can just simply, you know, um, then just rest up. And bond with her, and then, like, yeah, we'll see what happens. Over here, conversation. What is your class gonna do for the culture festival? A haunted house? I bet I'll be stuck playing with the ghost. Being a ghost isn't so bad. You can just show up and put on the costume. I have to do a magic show. By the way, did you hear a typhoon is on its way? I hear it's a big one. The school will be empty. Okay, when is that typhoon gonna show up? I don't remember a typhoon happening. Will it just say no school and will they be able to go outside? Maybe it would say you can't go outside. I don't know. I don't remember that part. We'll be take, talking about nuclear fission today. Imagine a nuclear reaction in which a massive nucleus splits into smaller nuclei, releasing energy as it does. I believe you all know that much. The reaction emits massive quantities of energy, which is why it's used in nuclear power plants. You all know that Japan has three nuclear prohibit prohibitions in place, right? Let's see, Minato. Which of these is not one of Japan's prohibitions on nuclear weapons? Wait, which of these is not one of Japan's prohibitions? Can't produce, can't let others produce. Can't allow into Japan. Can't let others... Can't let others... Hmm... Can't allow into Japan... Huh. Not one of those prohibitions. I wonder. Well, should I press can't allow into into Japan? Cause like it would have said the United States wants to place its nuclear weapons into Japan, like in a defensive way. Cause Japan is kind of also a vassal state to the U.S. Empire, so you know that means the U.S. can like be allowed to put in nuclear weapons there if it wants. But which is the correct- it doesn't really matter though, because it's just for charm only, so I'm curious. Uh, can't allow into Japan? I'm afraid not. That should be common knowledge for Japanese citizens. We forbid possession, production, and admission of nuclear weapons within Japan. Oh, okay, that's great! The third prohibition is a little controversial, but this is a physics class, not political science. Now it's for nuclear fission. Okay. Eh, that's alright. Oh, let's see. If it's Yukari, I mean, if it's Fuka, I can't hang out. Oh, sweet! She's available. Oh, my not to come. Perfect timing. If you don't have anything to do after school, want to hang out for a while? Maybe. Well, I'd be happy to save you for, from boredom. Now, let's see if we can survive the rest of the school day. Seems like it doesn't have much after school, maybe you should spend some time with her. There's Kaz. Ow, ow, ow. Just kidding, huh? Yeah, uh, I haven't decided yet. Oh yeah, well I'm going, so why don't you come? Seems like he's hanging with... Dude, quit late. 
quibbling him at me on my knee, I'm fine later, sorry. Yeah, we're focusing on Yukari right now, so... Well, good to know that Japan prohibits anyone giving putting in nuclear weapons. At least they have some sovereignty in regards to this kind of topic, which I respect. Because, like, the fucking United States, I do not trust one bit for anything. Everyone seems excited about the upcoming festival. I have not experienced such an event before. Fuck. I will say this though, it's kind of unfortunate I haven't been talking to her as much as I can every day on like when I'm talking to people at the dorm, so I mean, yeah, so I apologize for that. I'll get back to myself and come with you. Yes. Great, let's go somewhere. Okay, and then once we do that, we're good. But of course we're tired, so we have to rest up two times until we can go to Tartarus. Halloween Mall. You've gone shopping with Yukari. There's one more store I want to go to. You don't mind, right? Hold on, I've got a phone call. Oh. Yukari's expression has darkened. Hello? Yeah, what? So, get to the point, okay? I think that's her mom. Huh? It's not funny. What? How do you think that would make, me, make Dad feel? Fine, do whatever you want. Just don't call me again. Yeah, it's her mom. Can I hang up on the collar? Sorry. Who was that? What did she say? Are you all, are you, are you all right? Uh, I can say what did she say to know, but... I'll say, are you all right? Oh yeah, I'm fine. Thanks for asking. Aha, that was the right one. You know who, who I was on the phone with, right? Yeah, it was my mom. She says she wants to get remarried. I don't really care if she wants to get married again, but I can't stand how she's been living. Running away from life, jumping from guy to guy, I don't think that's fa fair to my dad. He kind of seems to be upset. Sorry, I'm okay now. Thanks. I'll never be like her. I'll never be that weak. Running away to forget your problems is the worst thing you can do. I've decided that I'm going to live on my own. I'll show her that I can be happy that way. Carrie shared her inmost feelings. Alright, perfect. So you know what? I'm going to just start bonding with Fuka and just maximize it. I unfortunately do not have time to, to go out with uh, Mitsuru. I mean, I can, like I said, do it on the next, fi like, next file like without doing it if I want to. If I can make it, I don't know how that's going to go. But, anyway, hang on. Seems Yukari thinks of you as someone she can trust. They should just grow more into it. Thank you. For some reason, I feel like I can tell you anything, minato -kun. Let's head back now. I'll do the rest of my shopping some other day. So let's go back to the door. I was gonna say, if somehow I have time, which I don't think I will, like, I was planning on making an extra of Persona 3, of what hanging out with the uh, Persona 3 girls is like. Basically with Yukari and Mitsuru. But of course it's gonna... Actually, that probably would be hard to do because I have to face like enemies and stuff. So maybe it's something that I could not do. Or I could still do. Maybe this could be like a... You know how I do SMGs where... Okay, save. Alright, so this is like... Now from now on I'm gonna be maxing out Fuka, so this file will be my extra file where I could do with it, whoever besides Fuka, but for now this one will be the one with Fuka, so yeah, we'll save right here. Save successful, okay great, and we not, should not touch that. We've, def we've defeated nine shadows, which means only three remain. That's fantastic! We are so we are so close to the end. Please keep up the good work. How are you getting along with Sh Shinjiro? It's the same thing. I heard Shinji's a really good cook. Yeah, I said that already. You look sick. Are you okay? Oh shit. Okay, talk. I'm glad Junbei Kun is back to normal. But do you think his relationship with Chidori Sen will work out? She's a member of Strega, and there are enemies. Uh. It'll work out. I really hope so. Nice. 
Shinjiro's son uses on an okay. Seems to be a very good mood. Yo, I heard there's a typhoon heading this way, dude. I hope it doesn't just pass by, because if it did, we wouldn't get a day off, so we'd have to walk to school in the rain. And that would totally suck. Man, do Japanese students have to go in the rain if there's a vicious typhoon? I mean, like, I mean, you know, in Florida, we always, like, get days off if the hurricane is close to us, so... Whenever I'm around Junpei, I sense a feeling of happiness, yeah. Cormar always seems to... Okay, I already read that, uh-huh. Have I already t Oh, no, that was, uh, where? Oh, there it is. So a big-ass shadow appears during the full moon. And you've already beat nine of them, huh? Not bad. <laughs> Sweet, I like this guy. Alright, we already saved, you already did everything. Kromar is on the move, but let's see if we can do a quiz game or something like that. Okay. Tanaka's not available. Let's see. Alright, nothing available. So we go straight back to my place. Okay, what I was gonna say, I was talking about something, but then I have to cut off myself. So... Well, I'm trying- oh yeah, yeah. So, I could make this, like, kind of like my SMG part where I could just talk and everything. Maybe I could do something like that here, while I'm trying to get to what girl to romance with, and, um... Like, obviously I could just skip everything, because technically I've, I've already, like, done this stuff. I could do that, maybe. So that's what I'm saying, I don't know what, but I'm still gonna keep that extra file, just in case. If somehow, maybe sometime in my life, I wish to find out what they're like. I know I could just do a YouTube video on that, but if I could just record my reactions, that would be nice. I don't know. Like I said, it's something that I'm thinking about, I don't know if it'll happen, but we'll see. You are tired, don't seem to be feeling well, and let's sleep earlier. Okay, great. Hey, Minato. Three left, huh? And the next one won't come for another three weeks. Man, why can't they just come all at once? That would be tough. Ha ha ha, that's true. But with more people now, it should be easier to defeat them. I can't wait for the next full moon. Alright. If Fuka's available, I'm romancing her. She's not available, then we'll just do something else. I'm gonna still keep on going until I feel great, so then, yeah. That's what's gonna happen. Okay, so... Akaze's available, but I wanna max out the old couple because they're close. Then we'll work on Kaze. Akaz. Deep apologies if I'm referring to him as Kaze. Sorry. Okay, so Fuka is not available. That means let's let's bond with the old couple. It says stronger soon, so I think that's a, this will be my maxed out, so we'll do that. It's perfect though, so that I can like leave it in this video. That's nice. Alright. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, yes, let's go. Spend some time, yes. Time to max it out. Bukichi is taking a nap. Please, wait a while longer. Even if the tree is gone, you'll still live on inside us. Bukichi is sleep talking. Take a closer look. Uh... Let's leave him alone. Oh, Minato-chan, you're here. You didn't have to wake me up. 
Or were you just eager to see my pretty face? <laughs> Oof. I feel relieved now, probably because the problem has been, has been solved. Even though it's the middle of the day, I feel so sleepy. Uh, what problem? Why are you relieved? Since Mitsuko is here too, I think it's time we told you. Minato-chan, we sent a letter to Gekukan. I told them to cut the persimmon tree down. What? What? Wow, you, sh you should have seen your reaction, Minato-chan. It was totally worth it to surprise you like that. <laughs> Sorry that we did it without asking you. Recently, I went to visit the persimmon tree and I met a student on my way back. He told me that the school is planning to build a new addition. It would be selfish of an old man like me to deprive those young people of new learning opportunities. I think it would make our son happy too, since he was a teacher. Helping those kids is more important than hanging on to his memory. Look at Binki- Look at Binkichi, look at Mitsuko. Look at Binkichi. We're hoping as we believe our son in, in heaven is, is too. That more, that more kind students like you, Minato-chan, will graduate from Kekukon. Please take this. It's the first fruit produced by the persimmon tree. It's a little rough around the edges like our son. Mitsuko is the one who suggested we give it to you, Minato-chan. Persimmon fruit. You feel the old couple's great appreciation. Wow, I, I, I really love the social link, man. Thou art I and I am thou. The bond thou hast nurtured hath finally matured. The innermost power of the Hierophant Arcana hath been set free. We bestow upon thee the ability to create Koryu, the ultimate form of the Hierophant Arcana. The old couple social link has reached its maximum level. You have mastered the old couple social link. Your power to create personas of the Hierophant Arcana has reached its maximum. You have forged a bond that cannot be broken. The Hierophant Social Link is at its maximum level. We can now create Koro Kor Hyu, Guardian of Nature. Now we have to cheer up and get on with our lives. We are too old to waste a single day. Our son would want us to be happy. I'm sure he's smiling down on us from heaven. It's difficult having such a well respected son. Oh, does it sound like I'm boasting? We talk with the old couple until sunset. After saying goodbye to Binkichi and Mitsuko, you decide to go back to the dorm. I love these two, man. They're so wholesome. I'm really glad I did the social link. I'm tr hopefully I can do more, you know? Hi, how is your day? Fantastic. I heard that Chidori san is starting to open up a little. However, she's still uncomfortable talking about personas. It might take a while before she's ready. Oh well. We still have three shadows to worry about, so I'll concentrate on that. They'll be sorry they really ever set foot into this world. The typhoon threatens to cancel the festival, which is a shame as student council president I have invested a lot of time organizing it. Excuse me. So I hope we can still have the festival, but I guess all we can do is trust in Providence. Trust in Providence? What? Hang on. All we can do is trust in Pro- <laughs> I mean, to be fair, the city, the, uh, the, the city is named after something, I don't know what, you know, I have to look up what Providence actually stands for besides the name of it. I mean, like, you know, I, I, I kind of get the gist of it, but it's like, I thought maybe it's exclusive to here, to, you know, to in, in like, exclusive to Rhode Island, you know? <clears throat> anyway, whenever I'm around Junpei, I said, okay, same thing. How can I help you talk? Junpei couldn't care so much about Chidori-san, I, I used to think he was a bit of a womanizer, but now he seems like such a gentleman. <laughs> I heard Shinji's a really good co oh, okay, same thing. Shinjiro-san used to be frequent- used to frequent the outskirts of Port Island Station. The only reason he is still alive is because he has knowledge and self-preservation. That quality makes him quite valuable in battle. Good to know. See Shinji here. Uh, let's talk to Koromaru. Looking at you pleadingly, he seems to go want to go for a walk. Shinjiro can, Shinjiro can go with you tonight. Uh, hang on a sec. Let's see if maybe I can bond with Tanaka or do something else. Yeah, Chidori's uh, gonna need some time to cool down, so I'm gonna give her some space. It's gonna be hard, but what can can I do? 
So as the biggest shit so the biggest shit up here is any very Yeah, not bad. Okay, read that. Is cat upstairs? Let's find out. No, he's not here. Okay. Then let's go check if Tanaka is available. And if not, then you know. We'll uh and instead of doing the educational game, I'll probably just go with a walk with Shinjiro, considering he's not there, he's not a temporary character, I wanna bond, I wanna be with him a little bit more. I can do the game thing whenever I want, anyway, like, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm very close to maxing out the academics. Ah, sweet. Let's do it. Oh, it's even out, sorry, free, uh, charge. Yes. I'm used to being ac accosted by people, but recently I had an interesting encounter. It was with a young man not much older than you. Guess what he said? He said, thank you. Are you sure? Oh, really? I don't mean to sound like a prick, but I could care less what our customers think. Haha. <laughs> they sounded cocky. <laughs> After all, we don't even sell real products. But then he told me he quit his part-time job and was going to study to become a public prosecutor. He wants to punish businessmen like me for bending the rules. He said I was an example of a negative role model, as if. Maybe I'm overreacting, but what if he does become a public prosecutor and puts me behind bars? Lord knows what they would do to me in prison. Would you still come visit me if I was in the slammer? President Tanaka seems upset. You feel like you understand a little bit better now. You know... I mean, if I was, like, bonding with someone and I get to know that person, even though they were kind of a prick on the outside, but they were nice to me and stuff, and they were to go to prison, I guess I would, like, visit them once in a while, you know, like, considering that if you were to bond with them, like, I'm level 8 now, so it's like, yeah, and I guess, why not? I want the shareholders to know about this. Apparently, kids these days aren't as naive as we thought. Where's the Tanaka left? Alright, we're gonna sleep sleep early again. What will you do? So that we can be at peak condition. And then we can do Tartarus. Great. If Fuka is available, we're gonna bond with her. If not, then that's okay. Over your conversation. Hey, did you hear? Yukari is going to dress up as a maid for a cafe in the culture festival. Wait, are you serious? Why? What happened? She drew the short straw in the <laughs> archery club. She's gonna be pissed, but that's all the more reason to check out the cafe. Oh my god, these perverts. But you know what? Honestly, I don't blame them. If there is a girl that I have a crush on and she's in a maid outfit, you know I'm definitely gonna be there, like, as, uh, like gonna be there as soon as you know it, you know? This is in for today. And there's Yukari, I'm not hanging out with her. I have heard that Yukari-san is going to be working at a, as a, at a maid cafe during festival. I do not understand why, but the male students seem excited to see her wear her new outfit. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, so that's about it. Let's see. Let's see if Fuka's available. No, she's not. Okay, so we're not gonna bond with her just yet. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, I know. What about like say you? I'm gonna. Let's see who I can do. There's plenty of social links I can do. Let's see who need who's the lowest, so then I can definitely get a, a upgrade on on you know. Okay. Let's see. Fool, magician, priestess, Fuka, student council. It's level five. Okay. Kendo team. He's not available. No, we're not. Hermit, we can't do that. Fortune, art club is level 3. Team manager, that's a level 2. Girl at the shrine. Uh, let's see. I, mean, I know Yuko is available, but I really want to like spend some time with someone I haven't, so let's do art club. I also really like, uh, what's his name? Let's see. 
Kasuki. It's been forever since I hang out with him, so I want to do it. Oh, hi, Minato. Kuna, are you going to club? Because he seems to be sweating. Since you have to see a person, you'll get along with him. Would you like to? Yes. Oh, I see. Well, I'm in a hurry, so I'm gonna. I'm going to go right now. I'll see you later. Kasuki has run away. You have decided to go to the art club. You're in high school art group. You arrived at the art club early. Kasuka is all alone. Maybe I should just quit. The club would be fine without me, and I... I'm not a very good at... I'm not... I'm not a very good at... I'm not very good at painting anyways, it's a typo. Well, I want to say typo, it just wasn't right to put the A in there. Haha. Uh -huh. Natakun, when did you get here? How long were you listening? Are you going to quit? Uh... Are you going to quit? Ha ah, ha so you heard everything, huh? Okay, that's good. I don't know about the contest. I could say that maybe I would've gotten an extra point, whatever. My dad told me I should quit the art club. He said I need to concentrate more on my studies. I told him that, that the painting I submitted was selected to be in the finals, but he said that I was just wasting my time. He said that because I'm his only son, it's my responsibility to take over the hospital. My dad doesn't care about me. He only cares about his stupid hospital. And why does everyone think I'm going to be a doctor? Just because my dad's a doctor doesn't mean I want to be a doctor too. Ugh, I can't take it anymore. I have my own dreams, you know? Complaining won't help. You should say something. But it's my life, and I just want to live it my way. Kasuki seems to have calmed down. So sorry, Minato-kun. I've got it, I've got it. I'm, I'm going to make a bet with my dad. If I don't win the contest, then I'll quit the club, just like he wants me to. But if I win, then I can do whatever I want. Yep, that's it. As soon as I get home, I'm going to talk to him. But please don't tell anyone about this, Minato-kun. I don't want everyone to worry about me quitting the art club, so let's just keep it between us, okay? He's open to help you really should be stronger now. Sweet. It's been, a, it's been a while, but since that we're now maxing out social links, things will be a lot easier from here, you know? So for four. Hey Minato-kun, could you let everyone know that I won't be at our club today? I'm going home so I can talk to my dad about you know what. Alright, see you later Minato-kun. Kesuki left the room. You, were, you participated in the club activity. After finishing the club activity, you said to go back to the dorm. Welcome back. There are over two weeks until the moon is full again, and already the lost are increasing in numbers. We have to stop the shadows at any cost. How am I doing? Fan fucking tastic. All right, so we'll definitely uh, do do the thing. So hang on, let me talk to those guys. Guess what? I have to wear a maid outfit. Why me? It's just not right. I agree. I don't care. I want you. I want you to wear it. Uh. What ha <sighs> Fuck, I'm curious, man. <laughs> no, no, I don't want- I'll just say I agree. I'm so embarrassed, I feel like running away. I don't want to make her feel bad, you know? I feel bad, you know, if I say that. There's a typhoon headed our way. I'm not sure if it's going to hit us or not, though. Yeah, I, I get that fear whenever a hurricane is approaching. <laughs> Shinjiro-san used to frequent the- out Yeah, I read that. Yeah, Chidori's gonna need some time to cool down. So I'm gonna give her some space. It's gonna be hard, but what can you what can I do? The typhoon threatens to cancel the festival, which is a shame I assume that I already read those. Alright. Let's talk to Fuka. Let's see how everyone's doing. How can I help you? Check everyone's status. Everyone's okay today. Would you like to know who, how are they doing? Just I need to make sure if they're all going to be there. She's being there, she's being there. He's being there, he's being there, there, and he's good. I remember he was feeling great, and now he's good, unfortunately. That's alright. He's also there. Okay. 
Yep, everyone's being there, so we're all good. Okay, how, is there anything else? Junpei couldn't care so much about Chidori-san, I used to think, uh, read that? Kromaru's first day, he's not in the mood for the walk. Yeah, neither am I. The culture festival is next weekend, but there's a typhoon coming, so it might get cancelled. I probably wouldn't have gone to it anyway. I really don't feel like being around a lot of people right now. Have I read it, read it properly? The culture festival is next weekend, there might be typhoons, so it might get cancelled. Yeah, I have. It just felt like I wasn't into it in the beginning, I'm sorry. Culture fest, huh? That crap doesn't interest me. This guy is such an emo man, but honestly, I, I, honestly, I can I can understand why he feels that way, considering he did kill someone. So you know, yeah, like I, I don't blame him if he feels that way. He feels empty inside. He's taking these addictive drugs, so that kind of makes sense. His his enjoyment his life is kind of faded. Okay, let's save. We haven't bonded with Fuka just yet, so we're still good. So we could. Save it on uh, this one. <clears throat> yeah. Save successful. All right. All right, we're ready. First, before we continue, I need to go get a drink. So I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. So we're ready, ready to go. Apologies if this was pretty much delayed a bit, but now we've done everything we can. So let's go to Tartarus. Mm, excuse me. All right, can't wait. And who I'm gonna pick? Sorry, um, who am I gonna pick? Um, I'm going to pick Junpei, Yukari, and we'll we'll take Shinjiro. Uh, hang on, check that. I think I I don't have any good armor though. Yeah, so these guys they have very yeah, they have very low armor. That's fine. We'll still take him. You know you need my help. At the party. Got your back. Alright, let's go at the party. Sure. Okay. Shinjiro, he doesn't have a specific elemental, special elemental attack, so yeah, so basically he's like, you know, mainly physically. Ready? Let's check status. I do have a weapon to give him. Heavy axe. Oh wow, we already have heavy axe, but this is 2 plus strength. Here you go, long pea coat. Oh, sweet. Okay, he has a very low defense, but we have a bulletproof vest. Thankfully, we didn't, we didn't um, sell sold it. Here, this has two plus luck. I remember he was complaining about how he doesn't have like luck. Okay, in life skates, I know if he dies, he's gonna take these items, but these are very cheap, so I'll give him those. You know, just okay, beanie, simple knit cap, and that's it. Thanks. You ready? Add to party. Got it. There we go, we have him now. I also have a good special weapon for Ken. Please take me with you. Let's check status. Cross spear. Oh, oh yeah, right, we didn't get that. I remember Tanaka was selling it on a show, but I didn't get it. But I forgot, like, I made me think I have it, but I guess I don't. Okay. I mean, since he's here, uh, let's give him this. I know I could just sell it, but should I sell it? No, 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 give it to him because you'd be low on defense. Okay. We don't have any good shoes, so yeah. That's unfortunate, but the defense is more important. Okay. Thanks. Okay, wow, thanks, sorry. Okay, so we're good. Let's go up. 